Hi there, they call me the governor, and I'm about to react to the finale of the very first season of The Walking Dead. Called TS-19, which means Test Subject 19, it finds Rick and his band of misfits at the CDC. Now this trip down memory lane has certainly reminded me of details I'd forgotten. Also, seeing Merle's behavior this season makes me question the wisdom of bringing him onto my team. But this episode isn't about Merle. It's about giving up or fighting on, and you know which I would choose. So let's dive into the first season finale. Time to react. I guess you can't. Well, that's not a good thing. Looks like some biters coming out. I guess you're having second thoughts, or you need the equipment, or... <laughs> I wonder if someone in a coma died, would they come back as a biter? Uh, I think it's gonna wait till it's a less convenient time. Do you think he's dead or? Well, soldiers are taking no prisoners or anybody else. Well, gee, that looks familiar. Didn't uh, Daryl do that with Judith? Except he didn't leave her that long. I'm not gonna do the dance. It opened, go inside. Ah, he's kind of uh, upset about that. There you go. That's easy. Oh, really? Have you seen Daryl? That's right. Now, this is the thing about the cave. <laughs> Him and a computer. Uh, I guess they got some food there. Get little Carl drunk. <laughs> that's, uh, that's good. <laughs> he doesn't like it. Yeah, he's uh, feeling a little bad about giving up. That's a good question, but you're not going to like the answer. Well, that's one way of putting it. <laughs> I would say. <laughs> yeah, he is. Hot water. <laughs> I believe they said go easy on the hot water. Well, that saves water, I guess. Two in the shower. <laughs> and he's got his lover in the shower, too. And Andrea's still just traumatized about losing a sister. Damn. Andrea's not doing too good. Praying at the porcelain throne.
Well, yeah, that's kind of true. There's Woodbury. He's not saying you're not infected, though. He hasn't gotten this drunk in a while. What did you really think? Yeah, you're fucking full of shit right there. You're not going to be there for years. <laughs> a drunk Shane and Laura showing off the legs, not a good combo. He's right. Well, that's quite true. He did. By lying or being mistaken. This is not cool, Punisher. Get a hold of yourself. Yeah. And people wonder why women are a little leery about men with tempers. Asleep or pretending to be asleep. She does a shame. He is very hungover. <laughs> we really didn't get to see Glenn all drunk. <laughs> Bet you do. <laughs> Good cover. Not to find details. Though the not a bad thing. How poetic. Well, that fucking sucks. Yeah, don't shield it from the truth. Besides, you ain't got that long. Test subject 19 was his wife. New synapses, but a different color. No, just the brain stem. No, just the brain stem. What was that? What was that? He shot his patient in the head. He shot his patient in the head. He shot his wife in the head. Yeah, that could be a problem. Yep, nothing left anywhere. You came at an opportune time. Just says everything's about to go to shit. It's just That's at least your worries. Test subject 19. Did you send your findings anywhere? Yeah, those French. More tenacious than you think. I think he did. I didn't understand what you meant, though. What is in HIT? You know, if 
this had happened and they hadn't gotten out, it'd be a very short show. I think those uh, axes aren't going to quite do it. <laughs> Daryl's always thinking with his hind brain. Well, that's true. But oh, more people will uh, come around. Well, not quite. Nope, wait till next season. Not far in. He's gonna... He's got such aggression. You get that out of your system? And who was the promise to? Damn right. Come on, let him out. But. <laughs> the day will come for a lot of things. You learn something there, Rick. Sad to see you, Jackie. See you go. Come on. It's like, is he thinking of her as a daughter or is he thinking of her as a piece? Oh, there you go. <laughs> Hang on a bit of work. Run like hell. Well, I did it. <laughs> uh, they're getting really good at headshots. It's the cars are still where they left them. <laughs> and he was like, well, you son of a bitch. Goodbye, Jackie. Goodbye, Jenna. Good thing you didn't park too close. Damn. Kind of reminds me of, uh, the end of the fighters in the finale. <laughs> Good thing Rick had a hand grenade. They'll be seeing you soon, Herschel. Though you'll be clean shaven. At least they got some uh, wine and food and some showers and now caravan to nowhere. Somewhere in those ashes is Cheddar and Jackie. You know, to my imagination, or does Dale really have it bad for Henry? I mean, I don't know if it's a, you know, fatherly thing, or, you know, if he's like, sees his wife and I don't know, but that was a little crazy. Trying to basically get her to leave by saying he was gonna stay if she did. But it's interesting that he decided to risk himself for her, not Jackie. Still, I guess I could kind of thank him for saving Andrea, though afterwards I kind of got this rash. Anyways, Rick learned something from Dr. Jenna before the left. We all know what it is. The rest of us had to figure it out the odd way, by killing people, which, you know, I can't really complain there. But now that they've rested up and cleaned the grit out of the butt cracks, it's time for the crew to move on. I don't know, maybe go to a nice farm somewhere. <laughs> I do think Dr. Jenna isn't exactly a great example of a scientist. The generators are running low on fuel. Figure out a way to get more fuel. No more test subjects? 
there's tons outside the door, you know, and find people. Can't order gasoline or buy this from Amazon, but really just giving up and being incinerated? I hope that's not in the CDC handbook. It would have been an entirely different kind of show if Dr. Jenna recruited Rick and his bunch to go get fuel and work with him towards creating a cure, find freshly bit people. Well, there's another alternate timeline for you, Kirkman. So we'll be moving on to season two in this reflection journey. And in the meantime, be sure to check out our Walking Dead trivia live streams every other Monday. And watch my alter ego, Captain Kyle, react to The Last of Us as there's plenty more of that coming. And please consider a super thanks to support this channel. Until next time, Governor out. <laughs>